Welcome to the Maths Made Easy tutorial on collecting like terms. So it, this is the last video on this topic. Uh, we're just going to run through some example questions, uh, starting with this one where we have two variables at play here. So we have to simplify the expression 3y plus 2x plus 4y minus y. So uh, what are the like terms here? Well, we have two terms in y, so that's the 3y and the minus y. And we have two terms in x, which is the 2x plus 4x. So I'm going to reorder the expression. So we've got 3y minus y plus 2x plus 4x. So now it should be pretty clear what's going on. So we minus the y from the 3y to give us 2y. Uh, and then we add the 2x and the 4x together to give us 6x. So our final answer is 2y plus 6x. Moving on then, the second example, uh, this time has powers in it. So we have to simplify the expression 4x squared plus 2x plus 3x squared. Uh, so the like terms here are going to be the x and the x squared. So uh, we treat the x and the x squared separately. So we have 4x squared plus 3x squared plus 2x. So I'm just reordering this again because I think it makes it clear what's going on. Uh, and obviously using different colours to distinguish between the like terms. So we just add the like terms together. So we have 7x squared plus 2x. So in this next example, uh, we have several different letters here. Uh, so we have to simplify the expression 5mn plus 3xy plus mn plus x. So are there any like terms here? Well, we have two terms in mn. That's the 5mn plus the mn on its own. So let's reorder the expression 5mn plus mn plus 3xy plus x. So we treat the xy and the x separately uh, because this 3xy, we treat the xy essentially as one variable and then the x on its own is a different variable. So when we simplify this expression, we get 6mn plus 3xy plus x. So that is a simplified form. So in this last example, uh, we have several letters and powers. We have to simplify the expression 2m squared n plus 3mn plus 2m squared n. So the like terms in this case are the terms in m squared n. So that's the 2m squared n here and here. So if we rewrite the expression, we get 2m squared n plus 2m squared n. And then we add the 3mn on the end. So when we simplify this, we get 4m squared n in total plus the 3 mn on the end. So that's the simplified form of the expression. Collecting like terms is a skill that's crucial to algebra, so it's important that you get a lot of practice. You can do so with our online exam. This is available through our revision platform. If you take the test, you'll find loads of different questions to have a go at, and all of which are instantly marked. So this is a really good way of keeping track of your progress, finding out where you're going wrong and how you can improve. So if you're interested, you can click the link below and it will take you straight there.